Hey everybody, it's Nicola here. Welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Leaf. We have mail today. Let's check it out. From the post office. Oh yes, of course. Dear Nicola, to commemorate saving 100,000 bells, please accept this box of tissues with our deepest and most excited congratulations. We hope you'll enjoy it. Yeah, I did a little bit of saving money. Um, I have just over 100,000 bells. I didn't really do as much money making yet as I hope to, but we actually do get a, a box of tissues, which is a furniture item, which you can get only from the post office, so it's kind of like an exclusive item, and there's a few of these when you save up various amounts of bells. But anyways, um, we're back here today for a couple of reasons. One, uh, the first one is because there's a new villager in town actually. This is our house right down here, which is kind of interesting because we now have like this curve of three houses down here, which looks kind of cool. So let's head into here and see who we have. They're right on the edge of the cliff, which is a bit, a bit creepy. They have kind of like this old fashioned style um, house, but kind of like a, a brick wall around the outside. Let's go inside. I don't recognise this house, but my memory could simply be failing me, of course. Oh my gosh, no way. No freaking way. You know how I said one of my favourite animals was a wolf called Wolfgang? This is Wolfgang. That very wolf. It's Wolfgang! Huh, are you from this town? Hey, I'm Wolfgang. Hey now, I'm not as scary as I look, so don't worry too much. Hey, I know, buddy. As you can clearly see, I just moved in here and I don't know anyone yet. I'm probably going to need a lot of help from you, so thanks in advance for that. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe I got one of my favourite animals. Oh my goodness, that's so cool. Oh. Well, I'll be sure to come see you tomorrow. It's also nice to have like a grumpy villager because um, I tend not to keep those, I'll be honest, but Wolfgang's a pretty chill dude, so wow, that's so cool. I don't remember his house being like this. I think I did have him, or maybe I only had him in like City Folk and Wild World, or Let's Go to the City. I don't remember. Anyways, holy crap, this is so cool. Oh man, I feel like I'm kind of wasting all my luck on like these kind of villagers when I maybe should be hoping for Frobert, but hey, I'm super happy. He's going to be a keeper as well, I think. Wow. <laughs> Jeez, I need to get more people that I don't like. Do you have fleas again, Muffy? Good lord. Um, <laughs> uh, oh, speaking of villagers I don't like, hey Becky. Hello Nicola, it's been pleasant today, hasn't it? What would you like to talk about? Uh, I don't know. You? Say, I'm wondering if you'll help me with my home decor, Nicola. I'm looking for something... Oh, I don't know. Something that looks nice with everything else in my room. Uh, okay, I... Again, I don't have access to much furniture. She came over to me the other day and she was like, Oh, hey, are you digging up fossils? And I was like, yeah, I'm digging up fossils. And she was like, Oh, if you find any around my house, then they're my property. And I'm just like, dude, I'm the mayor. Get out of here. Yeah, I think I found my arch nemesis, guys. <laughs> I think it's Becky. <laughs> Anyways, um, past all my flower fields. Ooh, blue violets, lovely. Uh, on the notice board. This is the other thing, uh, TNT Mart opening. Nooklin Junction has upgraded, which is really cool. Um, they were closed yesterday for expansion and today they have opened. And also on Main Street, there's actually another store currently being built, which should hopefully be finished tomorrow. So that's really exciting. Um, so yeah, here's TNT Mart, which is super posh and fancy. It actually has really good op opening hours, which is very exciting. But yeah, we have this other building over here being built, so we'll come back tomorrow and check that out. But first things first, let's head into the new store, because this is, you know, extremely exciting. Hello there. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the grand opening of TNT Mart. Come on in. Yeah, this is nice. So we have two fortune cookies, which I still haven't opened yet because you have to actually buy these with play coins and I haven't been bothered to uh, either sit here and shake my 3DS to get steps or to actually go out and get steps. But basically from these you can get cool items of Nintendo themed furniture and it's really worthwhile actually, but I just haven't got around to it yet. Um, we have more sections for tools here, so we can actually now buy this thing which is the megaphone which lets you, it's really cool actually, um, you basically shout an animal's name into the microphone and if they're around it'll tell you. Uh, so I will buy one of these just to keep it. Um, we can also buy the slingshot and the timer now I think, 
which are really cool items. The slingshot I'm very much looking forward to. Uh, I don't need an explanation, Tommy. I'm, I'm good, thanks. So yeah, we have still the carpet and wallpaper, which is really cool, we can buy, and three slots for furniture. So really cool store, we can buy medicine as well in case we get stung by bees or if one of our animal friends gets sick. And this over here, welcome. Please enjoy the Timmy and Tommy shopping catalogue. So now we can order furniture that we've found. So this is really helpful and this is kind of why I want to sort of collect all this stuff. Here's my box of tissues that I can't buy again. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, if you accidentally sell something that you didn't want to sell, you can find it here. You can look at all the clothes and stuff, and it's really cool um, just to keep track of everything that you've bought so far. I've actually... Oh, look at that. All the way down at the bottom, my work shirt. I accidentally sold this, and I kind of wanted it back, but now that I look at it again, maybe I don't want it back. I just thought it'd be like cool to have like a shirt and tie and like some jeans or something, but for now I can wait. Um, anyways. So yeah, this is the new shop, um, I'll be sure to come back and of course buy everything again. Uh, I do have a little bit of money built up, but I don't want to... Oh, that sounds really cool with my music. Um, I don't really want to like go overboard and spend all my money because there's going to be a lot of buildings I want to make, um, but I do have 100,000 bells in the bank. I was considering making my home a little bit bigger, but I still don't really just have that much stuff, you know? Um, I will pop into my house just to kind of show you what it looks like. It's pretty much the same, um, but yeah, we'll we'll take a quick look around my house as well. So I need to water these flowers later on today. Yeah, I'm really happy with like the hybrid situation because I do have quite a few. I probably need to start thinking about what I actually want to do in terms of decorating my town now that we have like nine houses in place. That's almost full. So. Yeah, I'll probably um, work on that a little bit. Are you in, Marshall? That'd be really cool. Now you're outside. Okay, that's fine. Maybe bump into you. That would be sweet. I always enjoy talking to Marshall. He's a pretty cool guy. And he's super cute as well. I think Flip's in. Yeah, he is. I'm just heading down to the campsite. Nobody visiting today, but that's alright. Um, I get kind of nervous when my town gets too full in case, like, if I have 10 villagers, which is the maximum, I can't actually ask them to come and move in. So I always try and uh, keep it at 9. Like, even if someone asks to go that I'm kind of like, oh, maybe you should stay. I do tend to, you know, keep that slot open because I don't want to miss out on someone that I really like. Uh, so yeah, we're at 9 now, just with Wolfgang moving in. I can't believe I got Wolfgang. Like, that is so cool. Uh, hey Muffy, how you doing? Oh, you still have fleas. <laughs> you're Nicola, you're already up. And at him. Yeah, I do. Uh, she's itchy, I guess I should help her out, right? Oh, me? Um, <laughs> trying to find holes. Uh, I'm trying to find fossils. Oh, I get ya. Yeah, you seem like you're good at that sort of thing. A lady working hard with her shovel, sweat on her brow, you're so cool. <laughs> Whatever you do, give it all you've got out there. Hey look, I can do that, but here, let me save you from this horrible existence that is you having fleas. Oh yeah. I got a flea. <laughs> you feeling better now? Ah, oh, what the heck, a flea? That's got my delicate lady skin. <laughs> yeah. You're welcome. Uh, I hope you feel a bit better now. <laughs> Poor girl. Oh dear. Alright, anyways. Um, like I said, a little bit of money in the bank. I actually um, unlocked a new public works project. Uh, I think it was actually Becky, which is kind of funny since I sort of resent her a little bit, but I never... I forget what it was. Like, it was maybe some kind of light? Ooh! This is a good thing I came in here. Isabel's sleeping. Ah! Mary Nicola! It's not what it looks like! Okay, it's exactly what it looks like. But I was dreaming about work, I promise! Oh, that reminds me! We had a visitor earlier who suggested a new public works project. She wants us to put a dream suite on Main Street. A, a dream suite on Main Street? <laughs> Where you can take naps with vivid dreams. Cool, huh? She needs support from the town before it can open, so this is where you'd be a big help. I'll go ahead and add it to the list of public works projects under the name Dream Suite. 
Yes, this is one of the very expensive things that I was talking about needing to save up for, especially considering I'm doing a video series on this game. So, Omer, I just remembered the townsfolk would like to hold a ceremony. Oh, I never did this, did I? Okay, yeah, let's go and <laughs> head all the way back over to the campsite. And uh, we're gonna have a little ceremony to celebrate building the campsite, which is super cute. Like, it's so adorable. Here we are. Ahem, hello everyone. Welcome to the grand completion ceremony for Lilico's vital campsite project. Thank you for joining us for this momentous occasion. I'm Isabel and I'll be your host today. Yeah, Isabel, woo! Thank you, thank you. You're too kind. We're going to keep this short and sweet, so let's jump in. First up, we have an incredibly short speech from our very own mayor. Take it away, Mayor Nicola. Uh, on to the next project. Yeah. <laughs> well said, Mayor. You have quite a way with words. Okay, moving on. Everybody, please locate that item we passed out earlier and get ready. And now, to celebrate the completion of this public works project and all the hard work that made this possible, ready, set, pop! Woohoo! That concludes our ceremony. Thanks everyone for all of your hard work and for taking the time out of your busy schedules to be here. Hooray! Hooray for everyone! <laughs> well that was nice! Oh, Dina, you want something? Hi Nicola, I need to talk to you. Woo -woo. I have a little favour to ask you. Flip and I have been working on a time capsule project. I got one put together but I've been having a hard time figuring out where to bury it. Since you're so decisive, how would you feel about burying it somewhere for me? Sure, I can do that for you. No problem. Yeah, I won't lose it. Jeez, you don't have any faith in me, Dina. <laughs> Store it in your pockets where you keep your letters. Yep. I won't look, don't worry. Okay, well I can do that for you. Um, Jeez, everyone's kind of like out here now, including Groucho. Oh man, him and Wolfgang are going to be like either best buds who like complain together about everything or they'll be like super rivals. This is going to be great. Can you like get out of the tree so I can talk to you? Hey. Yo, Nicola. <laughs> Dude, not again. <laughs> I just wanted to chat. Hey, you like to fish, right? I have a favour to ask. Oh, man. A river. Oh, that's easy. I can do that. Sure, no problem. It's my Nicola. You're the best. Alright, dude. Well, I'm literally going to catch the first fish I see and give it to you. And then I'll go borrow the time capsule and then I'll head back all the way back up to the uh, town hall and I will take a look at this thing that Becky suggested. Jeez, I, I can't fish anymore. I've lost all ability. Dude, don't swim away from me. I'm going to get you, you know. Here we go. Gotcha. I caught a loach. It wasn't hard to approach. <laughs> hey, Groucho, dude, where'd you go now? Why do they always like, oh my god, what's going on over here? Is this like some super secret, like, <laughs> meeting? <laughs> uh, Groucho, you okay, bud? Hey, I got you your fishy fish. Uh, here, it, it's a loach. What? A loach? Awesome! Don't fall off the cliff now. <laughs> Alright, I need to thank you. Please take my fancy yellow bar shirt. Oh, dude, that's sick. I have a yellow ribbon that'll go perfectly with that. Oh, I'm, qu I'm quite liking Groucho. This is what I mean, like, sometimes the grumpy characters can be total pains, but other times, like with Wolfgang, like, I just really like them and we get on quite well. Anyways, I'm gonna go, um, buddy this time capsule next to my house so I remember where it is. I always tend to do this because sometimes I'll forget when I've buddied it and the animal will be like, oh hey, can you dig this up for me? And I'll be like, sure? Or you dig it up by mistake too early. So I'm gonna plant it right here. Plant it, you know what I mean, buddy it. Uh, don't read it, just dig it. There we go. I don't know if I have to go back to her to say that I've done it, but I might do that just in case. But. Anyways, um, I'm gonna head back over to the town hall and remind myself what Becky gave us because it was something- I don't remember it being something that I was like, oh yeah, that's cool, but I think it was, um, I think it's still worth showing anyway, so, hello Isabel, I'm just here to check on the list of works projects, please. 
Alright, let's see. So the dream suite is 234,000, so I'll be building that as soon as possible because the dream suite basically allows you to sort of visit other people's towns in like a dream world. So like, you can explore to your heart's content, you can do whatever you want, but obviously it's not the real town, it's just like a, a replica. So obviously like, I can give you my code and you can visit Lily Cove and that's pretty cool, so if you feel like doing that you can. Um, so what was the thing that she added? Oh yeah, it was this wind turbine, which is kind of like a weird one. Um, I guess you could make it like sort of like a pretend industrial kind of area of town. Because that would be, you know, kind of interesting to try and create in Animal Crossing like a little sort of power station. Like, anyways, um, yeah, so Becky just, it happens when they like, um, come over to you like wanting to talk to you, like the little exclamation point appears above their head and they're like, oh hey. And sometimes they will suggest public works projects for you to build. And depending on the personality of the villager, you can unlock different things, which is why having a variety of villager types, um, personalities is actually really important. Um, is there anything going on in the plaza today? No, there's not. I think my tree is the same size as it was before. But anyways, um, yeah, it's been quite a, a cool day, like, productive day. I can't believe I got Wolfgang. That, that really makes me so happy. Maybe this place is gonna turn into, like, my dream town of, like, all my favourite villagers. Hey, do I need to, like, confirm that I've buddied this thing? Yeah, I do. Thank you so much. We'll let this be our little secret. Although I might ask you for your help again when it's time to dig it up. Yeah, so sometime in the future she'll be like, Oh hey, I want to see my time capsule again and I will go dig it up for her. Since it's right next to my house, I'm sure I'll be able to remember that. So I'm not sure where Marshall is. He might be on Main Street or something. Um, but I really do want to see his house kind of soon because uh, it's really cool looking. But anyways, um, I think that's enough for today. We've done quite a lot. There's been new stores opening. Tomorrow, hopefully, the other new store will be open. So I'll be back again tomorrow to check that out, which is very exciting because it's a shop that sells something that I enjoy a lot and it will help my outfits be a little bit cooler. So very excited for that. But anyways, that's it for today. So... Thank you very much for watching and I shall see you next video.